With more than 2 million Australian homes now using rooftop solar, industry proponents say the nation is on its way to a sustainable future. But what if those same solar panels end up in landfill? At the moment, there's no national laws regulating the industry's waste. And experts say there could be a huge amount of it in years to come. Amelia Terzon reports. This solar panel was pulled off a home in Darwin after it stopped working. It's got a failed back sheet and again, that's visible via these cracks and lines. And like many others, it's now destined for the tip. The aluminium frames will go into our, our skip bin and the, the metal can be recycled and that just leaves then the glass and the, the back sheet with the cells uh, to, to go to the landfill. But um, yeah, it's, it's not good. It's, it's not what the industry wants, that's for sure. There's no concrete data on how much waste the solar industry is generating. Most of the solar panels have been installed are only been installed in the past decade. These panels last 15, 20, 25 years, so the problem is coming. With 2 million Australian homes now fitted with rooftop solar and that number growing, the problem could get out of control. We have estimates that by 2050 we'll have 1,500 kilotons of solar PV waste. There's only one place in the country that recycles solar panels. From our perspective, it was something that was um, overlooked from, from the very start, I guess, of the, of the installation phase. The plant in Adelaide charges manufacturers and installers to take their old panels, and it doesn't take the most toxic ones. There's not much incentive for uh, anyone to actually, you know, recycle or refurbish uh, solar PV panels. There are no national laws regulating the solar industry's waste, but now the federal government is investigating if there should be. That could mean rules regulated by industry or perhaps just a voluntary code. Maybe the regulation needs to require that there is a cost component in that new panel that is for the collection and the recycling at the end of those panels at the end of life. Jeremy Hunt wants something done before renewable energy gets a bad name for waste. Amelia Turzon, ABC News, Darwin.